money gets showered on me eventually. Some of it is of utility to me and my family, uh, but we can only eat three meals a day and we can only sleep in one bed. And utility refers to usefulness. So you can have, um, so you, you can certainly say money is of great utility to everybody. With the money, they can buy the things that they need. You can also have a utility knife or a box cutter, which you can use for general cutting, or a utility truck, which would be a truck that can be used for different things. Or you can also have a utility company that provides electricity or telephone or cable different resources that people want to be able to live well. And that's the main meaning, meaning many people most familiar with, utility company or utility bill. So it's not very common to use utility to substitute usefulness or use, right? Typically you say some of that is useful to me, comes in handy to me instead of of utility to me. That's right. You, but, but at the same time, if something has multiple uses, it's often referred to as something that has utility. So you might say a screwdriver has good utility for a lot of different things. And there's a verb to utilize. A to utilize, right. Which means to use. Basically means to use, yes. But the, but the idea also is that the thing that is being used is useful. So if you were to use something that was not useful, it would not have good utility. I need to utilize all of my resources to find a new job. I, I don't have a can opener to open up the can, so I'm going to have to utilize a screwdriver which will work, but it will take a long time. There's nothing I want. And on top of that, there's a lot available for somebody that does need it. And so through ph philanthropy, you, you attempt to use that intelligently. Philanthropy refers to charity, typically on a fairly high level. Phil means love, anthro means man. So a philanthropist is someone who loves mankind and wants to try to help mankind. And the easiest way to do that is with a lot of money. So you can say that Bill Gates has become a great philanthropist since he has been giving away billions of dollars. Similarly, J.D. Rockefeller, he gave away billions of dollars too and was a great philanthropist. There's a big debate about who can help people best, whether it should be government or whether it should be philanthropy. And the argument in favor of government is that uh, philanthropy just cannot provide enough resources to be able to help that many people. ESL hyphen full steam ahead dot com. <laughs>